<laughs> Are you ready for another crazy Belama video from Belama Adventures in the Jungle? Uh, I have another adventure. <laughs> another thing to tell you. Mm, not so funny thing though. Um, now it's been like a month and two weeks that I'm in, in the jungle here and uh, I started dieting one week ago a little bit more than one week ago we started dieting tobacco and ayahuasca but the thing was that uh, I started having problem with my my toes my, my my little toe, you see this one, it started swelling up, it was like a week ago, it started swelling up more and more, and I started putting something, Unia de Gato they call it, some, some kind of medicine, but nothing would work, then this one started to swell too, and uh, in the nights I would, in the nights, when we would take ayahuasca, you know, whole night ayahuasca, uh, uh, these toes would be itching a lot, swollen and itching, and when I would touch them, they would be wet, really wet, and uh, maybe some four days ago, it, it was so swollen, but I started pressing it and it was full of pus, full of things inside and I started pressing and it started looking really bad. If you want to see. Now it is much much better. You can imagine how it looked before. So I started kind of pressing it and this liquid and this kind of mucus like thing like mucus you have in your nose starts coming from all over it's not just somewhere in some place it's just it was everywhere and uh, it, it's like you know as, as if my <laughs> as if my toe was rotten or something and then the skin started to go out, you see. Here you have more like flesh. Now it's now it is kind of healing, it looks better. So after I did this, a friend of mine told me that I could put on some clay. Clay on my on my toes. So that clay when it dries it uh, takes this uh, it takes the pus out. And I, I did this for the last two or three days I would spend the whole night with, with this clay on it felt like it was doing better but yesterday when I took it out this one looks better but I start having one here I don't know if you can see with this camera it's like a knot it's like something hard inside and when you look at it, you cannot maybe see it, it doesn't look good. The skin is changing and becoming like rotten also. And now we also have here another one. Here nothing. Then I have here all this place. Hard. Swollen up and from the under underneath as well. So it's no fun, no fun to have something that you don't understand what it is and I was trying to heal it, I was, you know, and things just go worse. Another thing I was having for the last five days was this stomach pain. I thought it would go away but finally yesterday it was so painful and it would last a long time, hours. Last night we did ayahuasca, it was 
hurting pretty much during the night too. So I decided that I I think that this is uh, some kind of parasite thing maybe. Uh, I I decided I have to stop my dieting, my tobacco and ayahuasca diet and come back to more normal nutrition and uh, uh, a friend of mine here gave me this MMS thing that is uh, maybe I'm sure some of you guys know about it I think it's a good thing like like against parasites and, and it's MMS is for purifying water and uh, for, for many things so I took it today and I hope that it will it will make my my situation better because it's no fun seeing how your toes are swelling up more and more itching it's no fun and <laughs> when you don't know what, what is happening you're in the jungle you don't know where you can end you know <laughs> you have all kinds of crazy stories from here from the jungle like abuelo the, the shaman has his his finger one of this this his thumb some microbes went under the nail and started eating the bone so he doesn't have the bone like up to here imagine no bone microbes ate it <laughs> i don't want any kind of similar microbes eating my my toes or feet or legs and now I have my son I have to stay alive so <laughs> so this is a new adventure <laughs> this is a new thing I am really hoping and I am really positive I know that this will get better as I stopped dieting today I took some garlic I know garlic's are good against parasites I'll have some ginger and some other things, just take a look at this. And it's happening all over now. Coming here and here, it's... Uh, all the time it's kind of itching. You can even see something here. It's hard, itching. Not really painful, but... And then the stomach, stomach pain, intense stomach pain I had these days. Yeah, I had to stop my diet and I'm sure things will get better now. So, <laughs> this is an update from the jungle. It reminds me of some years ago when I was in another jungle, also in Peru, when I got those piques in my, in my toes and close to my nails, these little small bugs flies or bugs or small animals who would get under in the skin and would eat their way inside the flesh and would start living there eating <laughs> what eating my flesh and putting their eggs like millions of eggs i had my fingers infected with these bastards too <laughs> it reminds me of that situation how i would have to take them out with with a needle or with a knife or with a small scissor. This time is different. Uh, however, I'm sure I will get better within these days. Hopefully. <laughs> uh, this is my tambo. A small, like a shelter, you see. Shelter from the rain. Mosquito net that is so important with all the mosquitoes. And you know, many times, well, not too many, maybe some three times I would I see those big lizards crawling all around. I took some videos of them. Interesting. Interesting. So, good luck. See you soon. I love you. Thank you for watching my videos. <laughs>